In, in your wickedness, you have broken the ancient commandments and crafted a bond with one of the light. Our laws are clear. They demand you be eternally imprisoned. As for the impure child, she must be kept from the path of the dark arts forever. The impure child. That's our MC, right? That's cool. Oh my god! Yes! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Bayonetta! We are finally playing Bayonetta for the very first freaking time. I'm excited, and if you are, hit that like button! Subscribe to the channel because it's here! We're playing the game! Okay, so let's see. I love this whole UI and menu. It's awesome. Right, so vibration camera seems okay. Sound settings okay. Display settings, we're gonna leave it, I think. I guess I guess we play then. What's what's in the extra content? Gallery Umbran, Tears of Blood. I don't know what that is. Maybe you guys can tell me in the comment section what that is. Here it is. Bayonetta, first time playing it. I'm so excited because I'm a huge Devil May Cry fan and it just makes sense for me to play this game. I don't know how I haven't. I don't know before I add, I have no idea, but I'm finally playing it. And here we go. Difficulty, we're gonna leave it at normal. In a universe of light and dark where perception is reality. Moon, I see the moon. Right, so who have we got here? Who who are these two characters? There's the MC there is the girl. I, I'm assuming her name is Bayonetta. Long since Bro erased from the records. Okay, time, I can Okay, okay we're getting straight into this. Okay, so circle seems to be Oh my god, it's just like the MC. The Umbra Witches. Dwellers of the darkness and the luminous control. These combos are sick. The clans hate each other greatly. All right, computer, relax. To maintain the balance between them, defended the just passage of time. Yet one day, that balance was toppled. Dude, I love the way we do roundhouse kicks for days. And I love the fact that it, it just threw me into the game. Is that a dragon? And stoked the flames of hatred. With, with no tutorial whatsoever, it's just like here, have at it. No help bar, just figure shit out. The conflict between the Umbra and the Luna threw all of Europe into a chaotic loop of battle, ambush, assassination, and casualty. It was truly a gruesome war. Despite the tremendous Bro. radiance of God shining upon them, the Lumen Sages were gradually weakened by the assault of the secretive Dark Witches. Years after the balance was lost, the war had ended in the Umbra Witches' favor. The Umbra Witches? Is that who we are? Are we a witch? Dude, this is like classic. Devil May Cry style combat, and Their I'm all here for it. Was I'm literally all here for it. The witch's dark Look at that freaking dragon, dude! Began to the I obviously can't keep getting hit like this in the, the actual game. With little resistance and subjugating those who wish to continue the struggle. Human faith in the miracles of their god pushed the witch hunts further, and soon the Umbra witches Keepers of the darkness were extinguished from the earth. Dude, I want to listen to the lore so bad, but I'm kind of distracted. Let's go! Just stay close to me! 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Bro, this is nuts! Present day. Buffalo of blood. That was... That was badass. They literally threw me right into the action. Okay. Is that... Is that the other girl? Blood. Lot, lots, lots of blood. Are they all getting assassinated? Like... It's cool how everything is displayed on, like, film. Okay, so here we are with the prologue. The vestibule. Graveyard, what a great way to start. Okay. Developed by Team Little Angels. Oh, I love that. This is cool. Cinematics director, Yuji Shimura. Producer, Yusuke Hashimoto. And director, Hideki... Kamiya. It looks like Humpty Dumpty's taking his last fall. Even Oleg Man the Destroyer gets scrambled in the end, right? You know, I still don't get why the hell you drag me out here for these things. I just drop off the merchandise. Hey, bet you can't guess what today is. Reading the good lord's book ain't gonna do much. People been waiting for this asshole to get whacked for ages. Please. Now, look around. There's no love lost for old Humpty Dumpty. But you gotta keep the outfit happy. We don't take care of him, they take care of us. And I prefer my shoes made out of rubber, not concrete. But hey, it's that kind of town. Without good-hearted souls like us to put these bastards six feet under, where'd society be? Of course, the pay's not bad either. He talks a lot. Can't you tell? Like, she's trying to concentrate, Jesus, bro? You really get into this shit, don't you? If it were me, I'd be praying he ends up barbecue. Or at least sunny side up. <laughs> You can keep praying, but the only way this guy's meeting the Lord is if God's hungry for breakfast. <laughs> Speaking of hungry, we done here. My kids are baking me a birthday cake tonight. Cute little fuckers, I tell you what. You've got kids? Well then, adios. What's happening? What the fuck? They're here? For this douchebag? I guess I would have to kind of put like some sort of disclaimer. I can't see a thing. The language and stuff, it's Yeah, there's no filters. You hearing me? You you can see them, can't you? I see them. They are instruments of God descending upon his heavenly rays to earth. Oh my god. Dear Lord, grant us guidance and keep safe the souls of our loved ones for all eternity. Whoa.
Oh. Whoa! This is nuts! Third sphere. Affinity. I was just about to say, is she about to kick their asses? Yep. In the most goddessy way. You look tired. Let me tuck you in. So are they are they like fallen angels or or, or what? Like Damn it! Oh! Oh, excuse me? Who is, is that? The freak? Next time you want me hands on you. You better make sure I'm dead. Now move out the way. He's got a hard head. Holy. Bro, 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 Rodan. Rodan. If it ain't my good buddy Enzo, how about you get out of here? You die, and I'm gonna have to go back in that hole chasing after the money you owe me. Do you naughty little angels deserve a good banking? She is. Oh my god! She just German suplexed all of them! Oh. <laughs> um, what just happened? Excuse me? What was that scene, bro? <laughs> I was not expecting that. <laughs> what? The sounds. Holy crap, dude. This game does not hold back. The music as well. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She puts the gun on her... On her heels? Is it possible to fall in love with a video game character in less than a few minutes? I need a drink. Cheers to Bayonetta. What is this game?
Dante, I think I found your wife, bro. Holy crap. <laughs> Woo. Okay, uh, we're, we're, we're officially playing this. This game is amazing already. All right, okay, we're actually getting a tutorial. For a quick punch, press triangle. Beautiful. For a powerful kick, press circle. Yeah, we were doing that at the start. Oh, combos! Combine circle and triangle to unleash combos. Oh, that's sick! Our evade with R2. Whoa, that's awesome! Dude, in the slow mo and shit. Woo! Gotta get the timing of that right as well. Ah! What a finish! Alright, so R2 is to dodge. Right, what's next? Which time? Dodge it at the last possible instant to activate what? Which time? Enemies will appear to move in slow motion for a set period of time. Oh my god, dude, this game! A very rare spiritual metal containing the essence of Angel's life force. Used in business transactions within Inferno. I'm guessing Inferno is the name of the shop. Oh, that's so cool, bro. Oh my god, this is amazing. I love this game. Already. Oh my god. Dude, she's so hot! Why is she so hot, bro? Now I know why people are so hyped for being at a three! Oh, this is so awesome. Oh my god, this game's incredible. What what the hell are those things? Ooh, halos. Alright, shoot your enemy shoot your way out of Wait wait wait. Hold Okay, didn't know that was a thing. Look at this girl's strut. My god, you rocket girl. She deserves to be on a catwalk. Rotate and press O to fire all around. No way! Yeah, let's give it a go. Oh, wait. This way. Wait, which one? Oh, wait. Wait, what? Once activated, aim and fire with... Excuse... Bro, that's actually insane! There is so many... There is so much potential for combos in this game. Holy crap, bro. D dare I say, the gunslinging in this is better than Devil May Cry. Holy shit. And that was one of my favorite things in Devil May Cry, but it was usually just auto-aim stuff. This is actually so cool. It is, in a sense, auto-aim, but... It's really well done. Oh my god, let's do this shit. Oh, you get all the angles, bro! You get all the angles! Oh my god, I'm Sonic collecting rings! Hey, 
So are they angels of death then? Is that what- Hey! Bring me back my fat guy! Hey! Uh, oh! Is that, it, is that your car? Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. Oh my god, the combat is so good! Oh god, is this guy like a boss or something? He's like a mini boss. Yes! Alright, I only got a silver medal. Dude! I love how everything about this just reminds me of Devil May Cry. idea how much this is gonna cost to fix how the fuck do i always get wrapped up in this shit ed and edna Ooh. engine still purrs nicely now about this little thing you've been looking into for me enzo let's have a quick chat see this is why i told you i was going home i just got held up in the air by some invisible things and you want an intelligence briefing it never stops with you you keep belly aching like that and you're liable to wake eggman from the dead eggman and i don't think either of you would like that oh. catch you later bayonetta something tells me you see what you did there on our special project before the shit hits the fan wait rodan what about eggman such a popular chap I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What? Don't you leave me here! <laughs> oh man! Oh no, loading screens. PS5, lads. PS5. Oh, what a day! I'm screwed. Ah! Oh, it's gonna take every cent I earned on this charade to pay for the damage. I tell you what, if I can see them bastards that did this to my car, forget about it. Forget so, about it. <laughs> I love that. So calm. You're still getting screwed in all this too. Of all the low-life scum in too deep in this town, I've never seen one get wrapped up in a fight with God's messengers. Oh my god, did the steering wheel come off? <laughs> Jesus, imagine actually that happening to you. Like, oh my god. end up in the afterlife, that's not going to be pretty. I can't help it if I like the little outfits. The toys are nice, <laughs> too. <laughs> 20 years ago, you woke up stuck in a casket at the bottom of a lake. All you can remember is that you're a witch. But now, you're stuck. Right. Because you got to sacrifice our halo-wearing friends every day, or they'll drag your ass back down to hell. So she has no recollection of her previous life. But being forced to slap around the divine for a living? That's really getting screwed. If I needed a biographer, you wouldn't be my first choice. I see to the funeral. You get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. Ha 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 ha! Come on now! Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! At least let me get a drink at Rodan's before you start drilling me. The info I got is good. 
It's gonna get you close to finding the other stone in the pair, and figuring out some of that lost past of yours. I swear. Flashback. <laughs> After jewels instead of cash. Just like a girl. <laughs> Jesus. Can't you take a joke? Enzo. Someone's given you a present. Hey, too bad. I can't stand bugs. Oh. There's a tracker on him. Is that who's following them? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh shit. Well, you're definitely not going to get that car fixed. What the hell? What well, what about Enzo? Oh, it's her friend, right? Oh wait, she probably doesn't remember her. Oh my god, we're the same. Okay. What was that? Finisher or something? Whoa, what's this? Umbran Tears of Blood? I'm a bit of a mean witch. It seems. What? Uh oh. Okay. We're running out of time, bro! Yes! Yes! Nice! Got a gold medal for that one, too! Woo -woo! Man, I missed the good old classic button bashing in these games, bro. It's, it's just so good. This game is so feckin' stylish, I love it. We got female Dante and Virgil right here, and it's amazing. Do you know what? Fuck that. These characters are their own thing. They're amazing. I love it. I absolutely love it. I'm I'm still like completely and utterly shocked that I haven't played this game. It is everything that I loved in games when I was younger and now. The gates of hell. Oh my god, dude. Those assholes sure know how to get attention. Even perk the ears of the hotheads down home. You don't say. 
It's getting harder and harder to tell the worlds apart. Human world. Inferno. Paradiso. Who can tell the difference? Human world. Inferno and Paradiso. Purgatorio in the middle. Fight long enough in there and you'll really lose sight. Why the sudden interest in metaphysics? It's a balance, right? Even if some of them like messing around with the humans, we've all got a stake in the status quo. But people keep fucking around like this, the Book of Revelations is gonna look like Mother Goose. Heaven and Hell are gonna go straight for each other's throats. Heaven and hell can tear each other to pieces for all I care. I've got my own problems to worry about. Something's up. Everything was a bit too brazen. And Enzo's tip makes the timing too perfect. This reeks of a setup. Someone in one of those lost memories calling you out. Whoa, look at this arsenal. A little present for you. These babies are special. Built from an alloy the devil himself would kill to get his hands on. Don't break these, because they're one of a kind. New guns. Oh, shit. Yeah, she, she liked that. Let's say Scarborough Fair. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude! There is so much inspiration from the Devil May Cry series. It's unbelievable. What an elegant and feminine twist. It's amazing. It's so seductive. It's hot. It's sexy. It's action packed. It's stylish. It's everything. You're calling me out. I don't go in for strange offers. Jesus, are those pistols or revolvers or what the freak are they? they keep throwing at me. Maybe I should aim for something a bit more high class. Pounding them down tonight, baby. Not to butt into your affairs, but I'm pretty sure you got somewhere better to be. The guys you're up against aren't the type to wait for you to finish a round. She's gone. <laughs> Yo. Enzo, her drinks are going on your tab, buddy. You did beat motherfucker. <laughs> Hey, I got a gold award, eh? That's not bad, right? It's a good start. I'll take that. Ladies and gentlemen, it's what you've been waiting for. Angel attack! What? Another tutorial. Wait, what? How to play angel attack. Aim and fire on the angel targets to rack up a high score in this thrilling shooting game. Boy, did, did I use up all my bullets? Shite. The Angels of Metropolis. I actually love the overall layout of this game's UI and the game's menus. It's done really well, it's super stylish, and it really fits the theme. So, I asked around and some whale in Europe is trying to fence a huge rock on the black market. He calls it the right eye, saying it's part of some set called the eyes of the world. Fits the bill of what you're after, don't it? Now, Here's the funny bit. The stone passes around the halls of power for hundreds of years, vanishes, and then the black market goes white hot for the thing. But the seller wanted an arm and a leg for it, to the point no one could stomach the price. So back goes the stone. But not before everyone figures out where the guy is. <laughs> You're gonna enjoy doing this one, I bet. I love sticking it to the rich. Of course, when you do, don't forget your old buddy Enzo stuck his neck out on this one. Slide me a few fuzzles out of the rich guy's pocket for my troubles, right? Anyways, you better get going before the trail gets cold. 
off to the middle of nowhere. Paradise of Europe. Ah, oh, there's Ireland! I see Ireland! Yeah, represent! Wait, well, that dude is covered in black. I'm assuming the NPCs are just blacked out or something, or? <laughs> Here we go! She is hot! Oh, wait a minute, what? Who's that? to be paradise central station platform look at the way she stands dude <laughs> that cannot be good for her back and then the struts oh my god this character <laughs> wow <laughs> she's hot bro she's so hot we can double jump already which is great oh my god i'm heavy Dude, the, the amount of com combos that we have at our disposal already is amazing. Alright, so where are we off to exactly? Through here, maybe? Yeah, it seems like we have to go this way. Oh, so looks like the subway's closed. Wait, what's this about? A resident of Vigrid. Maybe a part of the religious doc doctrine, but everyone is wearing holy vestments. As long as I am in the Purgatorio, I won't be able to intervene in their affairs. But that also means that I should be able to get around this place without their interference either. So that's where we are. The Pur Purgatorio, which is this world between worlds. Ooh, what's this? The sphere embedded in the wall is emitted a wondrous light and resonant sound. Getting closer to it makes it glow brighter. It's as if it has some sort of ability to respond to which is power built in. So we just bash it? Damn! Let's go! All to extend your jump duration and again to double jump. Yeah, we've already figured that out. Bro, I could watch your walk all day. There's a hole in this iron door for something to be inserted in. Alright, we need a key. Do we need to jump down then? Oh wait, what's that? Mandragora root. Okay. Looks like we can head down anyway. Okay, let's see if there's anything down here. What's this? An object bearing the seal of the sun. Upon the ped pedestal, there's an engraved headstone marketing resting place of a witch. There we go, we got something. Oh, she actually puts it on her back! <laughs> That's cool! Uh oh, it's showtime. Wait, I'm using the key as a weapon? I was not expecting this. Holy crap. It shocked me a little bit. I wasn't expecting it to actually work as a weapon. And for such a short period of time as well. Because we're using the key now and it's gone. I got pure platinum. Nice. Okay. Voyage towards the truth. I've been a journalist now for over 20 years. I'm always aiming for the guiding light of truth. Always pushing forward. I believe that communicating the truth is the core tenet of all journalism. Chasing it until my legs turn to rubber. And the truth is burned into my retinas. 
Wait, who who wrote that? Oh, dude, this game is blowing my mind. Oh my god, is this a shop? Oh no, it is set of two crystal statues, but one is in pieces. It has been destroyed in an unnatural manner, as if in a fit of rage powered by deeply held grudge. Wait, what? Wicked Weave. What? Wicked Weave technique uses your hair as a conduit to summon four demonic entities? All right, I guess. Oh, shit. Oh, yes. Yeah! Woo! Gah! No damage! Platinum medal! Let's feckin' go! Baked Gecko! Yep, I mean, that would probably happen to me if she blew a kiss at me as well. What is this? Lumen Sage and Umber Witch. When their powers meet in the test of strength, the lightning released will be your test. If you wish to walk upon the water, pure, pure, pure. Let's try that again. If you wish to walk upon water, prove your mettle by dodging the lightning in since in a single hair's breath. Do dodge? You mean like like dodge like that? All right, well, it looks like we're able to walk underwater. Oh, lift. What? Lumen Oh, when their powers meet and says... Okay, let's, let's try that again. So we need to dodge. There you go. Did I do it? I did it, didn't I? Did I, did I do it? Was, was that not it? Did I? Nope. <laughs> Three, two, one. Shit. An art that oh my god. Whoa, okay, that was literally like the last millisecond. I got a green laurel, a laurel shaped gem that contains vital essence in crystallized form. Revives one's vitality instantly when obtained. That's amazing. Whoa. Now we got a platform. Dude, this game is so cool. A lift powered by magic. Humans wouldn't would be able to power this device. They're probably completely unaware of the ruins that lie beneath their feet. Wow. Let's try walk through one of them. Oh yeah, they actually feel it. That's so cool. Dude, I love the overall aesthetic of this game. We're done? This town's teeming with heaven's little helpers. It's making my buddies downstairs awfully nervous. And your point is? Some places in this world are closer to Paradiso or Inferno. The rat hole of a town you and I live in is close to both. But the Vigridians, they got a special air about them. They're closer to Paradiso than anyone should ever be. And that shit just plain creeps me out. <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to set up shop here and score me some halos. These stupid rings are worth a fortune back home. Since it seems you're spoiling for a fight, if you come across any of these, bring them to me, and I'll hook you up. Well, you know Sega's behind this anyway. We got rings, we got an Eggman. <laughs> <laughs> I'm beginning to see why Enzo is so fond of you. Real cute. But let's get one thing straight. Your fights are yours alone. I'm only here to watch my handiwork in action. 
So don't get any bright ideas about coming to me for help. No. You get one thing straight. I'm not the slightest bit interested in the fact that you made these guns. If you get in my way, I will... How do the Americans put it? Oh, yes. Bust a cap in your ass. <laughs> right on, baby. Right on. <laughs> Right, okay, Radon is some sort of, like, demonic entity or something. Bro, that's nuts. Do we go on this? Enter the gates of hell? Oh, he's from, he's from hell, okay. Let's look, have a look around here first. There's a book over here. Central Station. Crystal Witch and Sage. The Crystal Witch and Sage. Within Vigrid City, there are a great many structures built long ago by the two clans, the Umbra Witches and the Lumen Sages. Amongst them, all have sun and moon duality, evidence of a peculiar outlook towards the universe. The Witches representing the moon, and the Sages representing the sun, burned into the fabric of the city in various ways. One of these structures, a pair of statues crafted from a high-quality crystal known as the Bellaston, Crystallus featured both the witch and a sage. The statues appeared to hold some sort of special significance. According to the ancient records, they were created to aid in the training of the art of overseeing time, a skill only the two clans were capable of practicing that also served as the key to locking something away from public view. Should the clans feel the need for secrecy? However, the exact details of this art are unknown. Now the city, scarred by the tragic witch hunts of hunts of the past, has seen many of the statues depicting witches destroyed or heavily defaced. Even these beautiful crystal statues were unable to escape the calam cal calamish calamitious calamitious fighting. I'm not really sure how to pronounce that word. So we got Umbra witches, and we got oh shit! I wasn't supposed to do that. There were. Oh, damn, there was something there. Okay. Uh, so we got Umbra Witches and we got Sages. Here we go. What? Yeah, what? What's happening? Uh oh. It's go time, baby. Third sphere. Applaud, Archangelus. All right. Let's do it. Shit, what is this? Oh my god, what is that? Second sphere of beloved. Oh, all right. It's okay, we got this. I'll pick this up.
Hey! Get off me! Damn! He's got some whack to him. Oh, there's his weak spot. Nice, I found it. Climax, mate. Oh, my God. What the fuck? I only got a silver there. I am... What? Oh! What the... F I am... I am actually flabbergasted by this character. Trois Marche Militaires. A golden LP featuring the crystallized voices of angels. Some sort of silhouette is drawn upon the surface. Oh my god, dude. This character is incredible. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> this weapon's ridiculous. Okay. Can really mix it up then. Wait, what? Oh shit, that's the attire I was wearing what at the start. Let's go. Oh, we got a little bit of a flashback that we're playing. Oh, okay. What? Okay, it looks like we're, we're, we're actually going to fight. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh shit, he's really strong. What the fuck? Oh shit, I wasn't ready for that. Oh god. This is. Whoa. What is this? Whoa! Not bad. Whoa! Oof. Uh oh 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 -hoo -hoo -hoo. oh my god dude yes dude I wonder when we're actually gonna fight that boss for real okay that was awesome dude just everything about this game is incredible and I love it. Oh my god, this game is so old as well, dude. It's amazing. Oh, we didn't do great. Ugh. I've discovered the existence of something called alchemy. It is the de de deconstruction combination and reconstruction of everything. Metal, flesh, even spirit. If one understands the logic of the age, alchemy is a prime example of the era in which it was developed. Although lesser known... Is the fact that alchemy is an offshoot of witch's secret art of concoction. 
Concoction was only practiced by the Umber Witch clan, and the materials, amounts, and methods used were never shared outside of the clan's inner circle. However, in the chaos of the witch hunt, some details were said to have slipped out, including knowledge of the primary mixing compounds, baked gecko, unicorn horn, and madragorora root. I think I have those things. So we can actually make brews to help us. Like, here's like recipes, concoctions. Right. Okay. I'll need to, um, I'll need to do something about that. Wait. What? Oh, oh shit. Okay. All right, then. You dickhead. Oh, damn! <laughs> the poses! <laughs> Holy crap! Oh, okay, you're, you, you want some more? Oh, damn! What is happening? Whoa, did I just die? Okay. He's coming back this way anyway. It seems. Yep. All right, dickhead. Whoa, what the freak? She's shaking that booty, bro. <laughs> Eat up! Yes! Yeah! This game making me so goddamn thirsty. That was amazing. Holy crap. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Woo. Time for more angel attack. Oh shit. Not doing so good here. Headshot! Yay! I got 25 points. Not bad, but not great. We're gonna save it here. And boom! We're on chapter 2! Alright, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, around the world. That was it for our first episode of Bayonetta. Our first time playing through this game, and my mind is completely and utterly blown. I cannot believe all these years I've missed out on this gorgeous, hot, <laughs> amazingly seductive game known as Bayonetta. I know I sound super thirsty right now, but how could you not be? This character is absolutely astounding in so many amazing ways. What a badass character with such great depth as well, with amazing story and backstory and just the absolute badassery 
this girl shows on screen just completely makes my jaw drop every single time. A game that I've missed out on for so many years, I'm finally playing it, and it's here on the channel. So if you guys are excited for this entire playthrough, you know what to do! Hit that like button for my girl, Bayonetta, because she's amazing. And of course, subscribe to the channel so you do not miss a single beat whenever we play this game. It's going to be awesome, and I can't wait for this journey. It's going to be a spicy one. Anyway, that's going to be it for me, lads and ladies around the world. I hope you all enjoyed. And as always, stay geeky, stay cool, be awesome, and be happy. And I'll see you dudes in my next Bayonetta video. See you later, dudes.